defend against that sort of brilliance. Remember, wrap around, use your shoulder, use your shoulder. Oh, that's way better. Well done. Yeah. Matt Gillette's been outstanding this year, and big thanks to Matt and the Brisbane Broncos for, for their help in, in getting this, uh, you know, getting Matt to be an ambassador. He's been, uh, been great for us. He uh, comes up here, you know, of his own accord every couple of weekends and takes the kids through a series of drills. Certainly, he's worked with the Falcons footy where he's working with kids who can't play mainstream rugby league or any type of sport for that matter, and they've got to work in a controlled environment. Matt donates his time there in making sure the kids, you know, learn something about rugby league and more importantly, that team environment stuff where Matt's really good at. Roll the ball. Who wants to run? Yeah, well, it's just to get the kids out here interacting with each other instead of, um, I suppose, sitting around home and and not doing too much. So it's good to get them out here on the on the paddock and um, teach them a few rugby league skills and um, they, they get a lot out of it. And um, there's some um, pretty funny little characters down there, which um, it's good to come up here and um, give back. Definitely up here at the sunny coast where, where I play most of my football. It's a, a great initiative. I think it is an important part of their lives. It's it's uh, something they look forward to. The parents tell me the kids really look forward to it every weekend and you know, they can't wait to, to get here. They're, they're always at the gate waiting to, to get in here and get on the field. So they're usually here about 40 minutes uh, before we actually start. But yeah, they're, they're out and they're, they're uh, having a great time. Go, get the tag. Of course, he does work with the AEIOU Foundation, just donating his time and his energy, which is great. He also does some work for the Starlight Foundation. He went to their Christmas party. And the other work that he's been doing is for the Cystic Fibrosis Queensland Charity. Of course, these, again, are, are kids with special needs, uh, hospital visits, and just generally spending time trying to make their day a little bit happier. Matt's a really impressive young bloke, and I must say I certainly um, admire the fact that he actually took the time to really listen to our patients and really interact with them, and it was just an absolute pleasure. We're a little charity. We really need some help um, getting our message out there and also helping people to have a better time of it with CF. And the things that Matt and the Broncos have done for us have been really, really appreciated. I've had a kid of my own as well, so we're very fortunate we do have a healthy, a healthy little baby, but it's just great to give back to some um, less fortunate people out there that do, do go through the tough times and um, any little part that we can do to help put a smile on a kid's face uh, means a lot. Get your ball. Score, score it. Matt's yes. a, a very worthy nomination for this award. He's a great ambassador for the game and a great ambassador for the Broncos as well.